I get put into elimination, and I don't know what's going to go on. I know Angela lost, so it makes me nervous already that she couldn't do it. So I'm hoping that I can. All right, go ahead and have a seat over here. This is way more fun than sitting in that room anyway. <laughs> All right, so the elimination is. I had to scatter these letters in order of the alphabet, which isn't too hard. You just go through the alphabet in your head, find a letter, and put it in place. But when you only have 20 seconds and you're nervous, it's a lot harder than it looks. You ready? Yep. Go. So what are you guys going to do with it? Money? Hmm? Fuck, I don't know. Hmm. I'm probably going to buy a video game. <laughs> my Vegas fun. I'm doing it to charity. You should pick me. <laughs> <laughs> You got it. All right. You did it in 14 seconds, which was better than Angela. All right. You got one out of three so far. Okay. Now the second challenge. You're going to be putting this mask on. I can't do anything blindfolded with a mask on my face, but I had to do the same thing, find these letters scattered on a table. And go. There's an N somewhere. Or is this the N? This is the N. And trying to figure out the difference between an H and an N when you're blindfolded is nearly impossible because it's two two lines with a little middle piece. Your head's gone. <laughs> <laughs> That'll probably be in the film too, can I do it? The lesbian talks, so he made me talk about that. He's like, do you want to talk about it? No, not really. He's like, go ahead. I, I already <laughs> kind of knew. What the fuck? Alright, that's it. Damn it. Fuck, I can't tell the difference between an H and an N. <laughs> You know how hard that is? Did <laughs> yeah. you try this? I, I did it this morning. They are pretty tough. I, so I, I just thought I was done there. I thought I lost. Nice. I had another chance. I had to throw pieces into a box. I got a piece so bad. Oh my god. <laughs> Hurry up. <laughs> now place this box right here. Three out of these seven into this box from right there. You got one. Ah, fuck. <laughs> I'm telling you, he's gonna, he's gonna pick me because I was the first one to pick on me. Button stand right here for you. Alright. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Tony did win the elimination. You have won the elimination. Alright, can I throw these other ones? Go ahead. Let's see how many you get. Killing it. Killing it. <laughs> so now he gets to choose one of you three to go directly home. Can I ask him if anybody like? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead and talk to him. Anybody real quick. got anything to say for me? Not vote him in. Give him a reason. I voted you last only because I voted you first. <laughs> I voted you first only because everybody else was saying that you were the champ. <laughs> I didn't know who else. He's to making pick. it up. <laughs> <I'm just kidding. laughs> Somebody's defensive over There's here. These two right here are just straight liars. I hate both of them. I saw corn live. Bloomington, <laughs> <laughs> call Sam. Well, I wasn't at that one, don't so. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty torn here because Ryan sat in here and said he was going to throw Ashley in when she was going to win. And then when she came back in the room and he was talking shit about her, I tried backing you up <laughs> and saying, no, that's not what we were talking about. But I got to stick with what I said originally. I got Oh. Told you. Okay. So I'm like, bitch is going home. I'm not saying bitch is going home because of, of Ashley. Bitch is like, as in everybody in there. And I think that's why he came back and voted her because, you know, he kind of got the hunch that she was pulling some strings when he wasn't there, and I think he was pretty much right in that. Well, thanks guys. It was fun. It was real fun. It was nice you. <laughs> well, now I'm totally screwed. <laughs> Did, were you surprised a little bit from hearing what was going being said when you were gone? No, because I walked in and they were talking about me, so I knew what was going on. It's not, it's not a surprise at all, because it's three guys against one girl, so they're going to gang up against me, of course. So. It's all right. It's the final three here. We made the playoffs. So. I've been sitting here. <laughs> I was ready for it. and just It was fun while it lasted, and I look forward to maybe coming back again sometime. Have a victory, Twix. Basically, he's gonna do something different than I am. Originally, I thought this was like a trick, like oh, whoever doesn't eat the candy wins. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. But now you have eaten enough candy. You, know, <laughs> you, you drink enough beer that I think it's all right to have just one Twix. <laughs>
How much candy you ate though? He's like, how much sugar high over here? Yeah. It's not all me. I promise. <laughs> you do, but you can't tell it. Yeah. I thought that was going on. All right, guys. Enjoy your last hour in the room. After this, there will be a challenge to see who goes home with one hundred dollars. So. So no more eliminations. We let it know like. If we were just going to get eliminated like one by one until there was one person left or down to the last two, they had to fight or something. Hmm. So we're all going to take a challenge for a hundred bucks. All we did was talk about what's this final challenge going to be and how's it going to work and do we're going to do eliminations first and, and uh, what are we going to have to eat something. There's got to be something that a guy or a girl could win so it's nothing like that. It can't be the same challenge because you, you can't do the same challenge again. Yeah. Right? Just put, just trying to, you know, my head's turning a little bit up here. Gears are fucking grinding. Unless he just like pissed all over his basement and he's gonna have his like army crawl through it or something. That's pretty gross. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if it's just like a luck for the draw kind of deal. Yeah. We have no idea what's in store for us for the, I think it's the final challenge. It's gonna be interesting to see how this all pans out. Only God knows why! All right, woo! Making that money. That's one thing that pissed me off about her. She didn't, like, she didn't know who Tupac was. Don't call him Tupac. Tupac. Well, she's gone. <laughs> oh, she sees his lighter and hates me. If I go, I'm gonna go fuck right here. Where you at? <laughs> Not here. <laughs> is that what the, the challenge is? The Jonas won at the end. <laughs> I win. <laughs> <laughs> I fell before me. Yeah, I really did. How did you still eat candy? If you oh. thought nothing happened in the third and fourth hour, then you didn't. You shouldn't even watch this next hour because. I'm ready for this challenge though. It's going to be interesting. Are you happy with the, the three guys that were at the end there? Absolutely. I was happy with everybody today. You meet new people, you know, don't know until you spend six hours with them in a the room. <laughs> if you weren't going to win and one of those two were going to win, who would you want to win? Hmm. I gotta go with Ryan, because he's a new guy. He's the underdog. That's, that's who I would root for if I wasn't in it. But obviously I'm in it, so I'm rooting for myself. <laughs> Guess we'll see what happens, you know? I, I think a lot of people are kind of shocked that I made it this far, so I don't want to, like, let anyone down or really kind of now. I'm kind of invested in this whole thing, so I'm going to have to try and I'm go balls to the wall and see what I can do. Should be interesting. Well, we go downstairs to look at our final mission, and there's a bunch of junk. I'm like, oh, we're going to have to do some of all this junk. But no, that's just Scott's junk. Come on over and stand in front of one of these gloves, if you would. What, ha what is going to be ha ah! There's some stuff on the ground that hurts my feet. All right. What's going to be happening right now, this is the final task that you guys have to do. You stayed in a room for six hours with each other. You got past eliminations. Regardless if you are in them or not, but you are here. You are here and so close to $100. In front of you, you have a bucket full of some nasty stuff and a glove. This bucket full of nasty stuff includes the following. It includes orange soda, pickles, Italian dressing. You got some chocolate syrup. Whipped cream is also in there. Try not to puke in my mouth. <laughs> I think that's the first thing I tried not to do, just listening to it and just like the vicious challenge, just like anything else that Scott's done. There's gotta be something nasty. Probably a little bit of the semen, I'm sure, just to get everybody, you know, get his, get his fits in. You're gonna need to stay on these sheets. If you step off the sheets, you will have a time penalty. What you're gonna be doing is you're going to We have to use these gloves, grab up this soup, and take it to these cups and fill them up. And there are multiple cups on the other side of this area. They are going to have an X on the bottom. You're gonna have a final cup at the end. 
It's a clear jar. You're gonna fill that up to the line that is specified to your color. When you get that done, you're gonna put that cup as much as you can fit in your mouth and you're gonna hold that in your mouth. That guy put in our mouths, he's like, don't worry, I won't make you guys eat that shit, it's way too nasty. And then he's like, gotta put it in your mouth. Oh. And then you're gonna come over and you're gonna have three things that you need to write down. There will be a piece of paper that will specify exactly what you need to do. And that is the winner of $100. And three, two, one, go. shit in our hands, just basically walking with it, it's falling out of our hands, getting nothing in the cup. And at first I had it in my hand, and all the liquid's falling in through my fingers and my hands, like as hard as I'm trying to hold it, all that liquid's just falling right off of this glove. And all I'm putting in these cups are just pickles, and that's it, and like a little bit of liquid. I was like, said you gotta use the glove, right? I'll fucking just pull her off, go back to the first cup, just fill it all the way up. I had a whole cup and just one. And then I see Dalton has his glove off doing something with it. I'm like, oh, we take our gloves off? And I hear Scott say, just use the gloves. So I'm like, well, that means not no. So I take my glove off and I just start scooping that stuff. Mouth. I'm way ahead of everybody. Put it in my mouth. <sighs> Threw up. I got to the edge. I'm just like take a deep, deep breath. And just <sighs> held it in. Smart. You write them down. Ah. And just put as much as I could in my mouth, and then just took off running as fast as I could back to the, the thing. And I see Dalton come over, just put it in his mouth and go, like that's his favorite snack. He's just like, oh, this stuff? Yeah, whatever. Let's go. Once it's in my mouth, yeah, it didn't taste the greatest. But I guess when you drink that many beers, you're fine. <laughs> <laughs> Questions were named three states and their capitals, not including Illinois. And I was like, I got this all day. I know. I know pretty good most of the states. So I'm like, well, if he can do it, I can do it. So I, I got my nuts up and I did it. This is easy because I did all 50 states and capitals and, and like I was the first one in my fourth grade class to do it. So that, that was no problem. I could have done any three states, but I just went with some oddball ones thinking no one else would get them. I don't know why that would matter. But I was like, no one else is going to know these, and I did those. You done? Spit it out. Then I'll check in here in a second. But then I probably would have finished first, but I decided to write out all of Alaska, and then I decided to write out all of Sacramento. I, couldn't, I didn't decide just in California, I didn't just abbreviate, and then I'm like, why am I writing all these letters? I'm trying to get done quick, so then I started abbreviating. What does your first one say up here? Indianapolis, uh, Indiana. I don't know, man. That looks like an IL to me. Dude! I ended up putting Illinois on Indiana, but, I mean, I, I knew what I meant to say. I said it verbal. Like, he said, what's his first answer? I didn't even look at the capital part. I said Indiana. Dalton did finish just a little bit before, so Dalton is the winner of today's $100. And Give it to me in a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> I guess beat me, even though he wrote down Indianapolis, Illinois. That's what he wrote down. Like, if we had left and Scott was to review this by himself, he would have had Indianapolis, Illinois. It's clear as day. And I would have won, but 
he asked him what he wrote down, and he said the right answer, so I, I guess that counts. Whatever. You know, I uh, I genuinely tried to get invested in it. I genuinely tried hard. Uh, I wasn't paying attention to uh, Dalton, who was filling the entire glove up. And uh, had I caught on to that idea a little bit sooner, um, I might have been joining them in the gag fest uh, that, that definitely happened after. I think after all this, I have a whole new respect, especially for Tony. Because <laughs> uh, Art goes out to him, he didn't win, but... All right, I appreciate you coming out. Now i got to wash my clothes, unfortunately. But... <laughs> And take a shower and brush my teeth about six times, but it'll be all right. As a whole, it was a blast. It was really a lot of fun for a Sunday. Uh, I met a lot of new cool people. I'm going to be a winner in my own heart. <laughs> the sequel, it's going to be tough to top this. I mean, this really set a new standard that I don't even think TV shows could really set too easily, so it was a lot of fun. I'll be okay. I won $20. better than nothing. I got to eat some nasty shit. I got to hang out in my room for six hours and... <laughs> Talk about nothing. <laughs> when you do some, uh, when you do some like character films and, and actually put together like a film, like call me up, man. We'll uh, we'll hook it up. It'll be a lot of fun. All right. And the next film I feel like is going to be everything down there right now, and I feel like a guy that just wants to drink that <laughs> for his life. That's his life goal is to drink everything down there. Well, I think Dalton should be the main character. <laughs> Got five dollars for you. We do. And 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, five dollars for charges of being in the house for heat and whatnot. <laughs> 105 dollars off for you, man. Hopefully we all can look back and laugh on the entire experience. So.